Oh, hello, hello. It is time for more Fire Emblem Warriors of the Hopes. Last time, we began our advance on the kingdom alongside our new allies. As for what our allies are doing right now, I'm not fully sure, but I know that we pushed pretty far ahead, and we'll likely finish at least one chapter today. We'll have to see how the war continues after all that. I don't think there's much else to say. Um. <laughs> that's 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 pretty much it. So I guess without further ado, let's hop on into it. Here we go. Oh yes, I recall what we were going to do today. Right, 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 right. After we finish the chapter, which should come fairly quickly, and it's frozen. Um, after we finish the chapter, which should come fairly quickly. We sh Sorry, that's the wires here. Um, uh, we were gonna go and just do a ton of lore reading. Right, 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 right. I remember now. We also apparently have some work to do here with the support conversations and facility, which is still on the screen, even though nothing else is moving. Okay. Now we click this button. And we open the settings. And now it works again. Right, perfect. I always knew it was a technical genius. <laughs> All right. Uh, facilities master first. Let's go ahead and just expand whatever we need to expand. Allow me to assist with any matters regarding the facilities. Oh, any of the final level stuff. Okay, okay, okay. Increases types of resources and ingredients. Gold obtained when winning a battle. Types of weapons. Types of goods, types of gifts. I don't think we're hurting for gold right now. I'm going to be completely honest. I don't think we're hurting for gold, and we will probably get the opportunity to upgrade that later. I'm really not interested in buying that many weapons. Simply due to the fact they don't get any modifiers. If you just get the plain weapon itself. Which can be great sometimes if you really just have one unit that you, it's just really falling behind with their weapon. You just need something on them. But I don't have any of those units. 
it's probably more helpful if you're somehow big brain enough to go and use the entire like army meanwhile i'm only using what, 12 of them something like that so i don't have to worry so much about micromanaging everybody's weapons so we're just gonna go with this and hope that this allows me to buy stuff like um what's it umbral not umbral steel Mithril. Mithril. That's what it is. Mithril. Emerald Steel is the alternate to that. Let me know. Um, I'm actually going to go and check. Because why not? I don't think it's the armor that we have to check, but I'll check. Yeah, no, not the armor. Goodbye. Oh, yeah, not either. I carry a little of everything here. Do you have? Uh, don't tell me that. Don't. Thank you for nothing. <laughs> Should have just gone and. There you go. You got Mithril. Thank you. Emerald Steel is also pretty good to have. We have 24 of it, so we didn't need it as much, but I'll buy it anyway. I might as well get... We'll get a guard team too, because that's fairly rare. Everything else I think we got a decent chunk of. Yeah, pretty much. Black Sand Steel probably could use a little more of that, but I don't think it's worth it to spend my money on three. Okay, support conversation time? Support conversation time. Jez and Linhart. Ah, it's you. How's it going? Any developments to report? You mean with my power? Not really, no. Hmm. Perhaps using it regularly won't be enough to provoke growth. Good to know. <sighs> hey, I thought you said you weren't interested. I mean, how many times are you going to come ask me if anything's changed before you're happy? Weren't you the one so keen on piquing my interest? I only wanted to check how that was going. If you don't think it's possible, just tell me and I'll stop asking. I'm very confused on what's going on right now. Um, I'm going to dodge the question because I'm confused. It's too soon to say, really. Right, of course. We'll just have to keep trying, then. How about this? Describe the circumstances in which you first awakened to your power. I thought I died. Maybe we can reproduce the situation and see if lightning doesn't strike twice. Oh, it's not. <laughs> well, I was staring death in the face when it happened. I'd been beaten so badly I could barely stand. I kept telling myself I wasn't ready to die yet. Then, out of nowhere, it just came to me. Hmm. I suppose we shouldn't try to recreate those conditions. <laughs> Nobody wants a dead officer on their hands. Let's consider some other potentially relevant <laughs> factors. Who was your opponent? Where did the struggle take place? Okay, now the opponent? What time of day was it? Do you that think your probably took played some sort of effect. I was fighting the Ashen Demon of all people. I hope we get the chance to cross swords again someday. As for the when and where, we were in a forest at night. I'm pretty sure it was a full moon, too. And that leaves my emotional state. But I don't know how I could replicate the intense emotions of being at the brink of death like that. I see, I see. That context would prove quite tricky to simulate. And if your power functions similar to a crest, revealing itself even when you don't intend it, that leaves only one option. Observing you on the battlefield at all times. Ugh, this is turning out to be more work than I signed up for. 
Yeah, go get him. <laughs> Weren't you telling me not to give up just a second ago? If I can do it, then so can you. Hmm. I'm not so sure. Okay. Sure, whatever. Ferdinand and Hebert. Oh boy, this should be interesting. Quite a few locked conversations, too. So when it comes to precedent, that is the situation. Yes, I see. Burning the midnight oil, are we? Such zeal. Ah, Hubert. What are you doing here at this hour? Up to your usual intrigues behind Edelgard's back? I would thank you not to make such blind and rude assumptions when you lack any basis for them. Well, uh, yes. I suppose I was making assumptions. You have my apologies. Not at all. I am, in truth, up to my usual intrigues. So your amends are quite unnecessary. Oh, all right then. Uh, hold on a moment. <laughs> you were? In any event, like, what are you reading? Hey, screw you, person? but first of all, uh, you're right, though. <laughs> Listen to me, Hubert. I... A book of past judicial precedent, is it? Ah, and specifically concerning the prosecution of nobles. Yes, I have a mind to settle matters with my father. The letter of the law considers rebellion a capital crime, but practically speaking, that is not the case. Members of the nobility are especially likely to be granted clemency. And all the more so in recent years. Yes, they expiate their guilt by surrendering peerage, providing assets and information, and leaning on the strength of their past meritorious deeds. In short, the nobility make full use of every excuse available to hold tight to their miserable lives. One could pluck off their arms and legs and leave them to fester in the dankest of prisons and they would still come wriggling back to the surface. So long as they are permitted to live, that is. Like with the former Marquis Vestra? That one did not serve his emperor properly and acted in a manner easily construed as treasonous. This is incontrovertible fact. Go on. Sadly, he resisted arrest and lost his life in the unfortunate incident that ensued. His guilt or innocence on the matter of treason will remain forever shrouded in mystery. That sounds like a careful bit of sophistry to me. It appears to anyone with half a mind that you thought him guilty and had him executed. As a noble, he should have been judged in public, as is right and proper, no? And remind me again, whose father escaped while the law attempted to do just that? So long as they are permitted to live, the noble creature struggles desperately to continue doing so. Such is ever their nature. And that is exactly why I am investigating precedent. Once my father is recaptured, I seek for him to never again know the taste of freedom. I will not allow him to stage a comeback. I will see my father properly judged for his crimes. And if he were to raise an army, I would have no choice but to lay him low upon the battlefield. But could you, if matters came to that? I wonder. It is not a question of can or cannot. The man will be dealt with, and by my hand, I could never forgive myself otherwise. Not as the inheritor of the title of Duke Iyer, nor as the one to succeed him as Prime Minister. It is for Her Majesty to decide such things. However, if it proves to be in Her Majesty's interest, I suspect this resolve of yours will be most welcome. Oof. 
Oh boy. There is there was nothing pleasant about that one. That uh that was so sort of uncomfortable conversation to sit through. I felt like I was hearing something I should not have. Thanks for the feather, buddy. Okay, to the warm-up? To the warm-up. Alright, we only got... Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. The one we can only take infantry units in. That's right, that's right, that's right. So not Ferdinand, because we have swords. Okay, swords, bows, and gauntlets. Of course, I went and made Bernadetta a bow knight. It appears it may be time for Shamir to debut. Unfortunately, they are all infantry, so dark mages around this time. Marianne will prove to be of use. Um, that was 31 versus 35 on Jez, so we're going to go with Petra. To be so we'll have to remain neutral at the very least against the mercenaries. I guess this is how we'll do it. I can't really think of any other way to really do this. Yeah, okay. Here we go. Petra will be going down to the bottom to seize. Let's clear it out. Hey there, buddy. Let us take them by storm. I'd rather be attacking than defending. I still find this pool of therapy very annoying. Gotcha. I cannot see your health bar. It was not enough. Yep. No, not quite. Got him. Oh? We've got you. Are you sure about that? Are you sure you got me? I see. So, you don't. That's what I'm hearing. I'm going into the wrong area. Not you, advisor. Don't give him a chance to retaliate. 
Got you, got you, got you. Yep, got you. Uh, that's about half the health. Bonk. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Perfect. Yeah, I would have preferred to shrink, as per usual, but oh well. Stronghold Captain. Oh boy. Um. I've got it. Okay, go and seize. Give it a shot. Did we get rid of the archer? No. Almost. But not quite. Use this stronghold well. Oh boy. We got to do a little bit of work here. <laughs> Green units will not be okay on their own. Okay, we're just going to have to do this. Okay, good. Ah, oh, fudge, it's grapplers at all of them. Yep. Okay, uh, they're just gonna have to do their own thing for a moment. This. This. That both of them? Almost both of them. Come on. Go. There we go. Oh, I'm not going to have enough to last. We're done for. The rest is up to you. Okay, that should be good, right? Should at least get the archer. Is probably the biggest thing here. Oh, that was disorienting. Got you. That is not enough to defeat the archer. This might be, though. Bonk. Yep. Come on. No archers allowed on my watch. No, not him. Him. Nope. He's fine. I'm coming. I'm coming. We weren't strong enough. Not allowed to die just yet. Oh, you were doing fine. Ow. Alright, I'm just gonna carry you away from here for a minute. Just don't mind me. We got all of them in there. Nice. Okay, well that just makes this easy. Oh, 
Nice. No matter what, I will not misplace my heart. Oh, sorry, give me one minute, second. Okay, sorry. <laughs> How, are, how did everything else that was higher ranked than you? Oh no, never mind. They just—they were just flung about. They didn't actually. Okay, excuse you. Come on! Come on! There we go. I think now we're good. What what is what's going on here? I have okay. There we go. That works. <laughs> oh, hello. I was. I thought we were done. <laughs> My controller is like about to take a drink. Oh, I just got smacked right in the face. What's next? Remind me. Oh, there, General. Not you. I said the General. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Are you kidding me? Are you are you freaking kidding me? I finally found so many. I set the controller down. I thought we were done. It said main mission complete. I thought we were done. Fuck. If I didn't feel cheated out of that, I probably would have let it happen and said, you know what? So be it. not one of my original group but I feel very cheated out of that let us go I'm just doing what I was paid to do okay please excuse me yeah. is this okay leave this one to me perhaps I should not have Thank taken you. control I've got it it takes the captain Meager though it may be. Let's clear it out. Hello, strong captain. Time to die. Get you even faster this time because I'm back into the swing of how this class runs. Yep, goodbye. Yep, don't mind me. Just gonna go fight the str the not the stronghold, the advisor. Then the stronghold. Afterward the after the advisor, the stronghold. We can ill afford defeat here. Hello, advisor. Oi! Thought you were allowed to do that. In the middle of my special move. Leave this one to me. That's my cue. Please, is goodbye. Done and done. Now, what's next? I don't know who I just got the credit on, but I got the credit on somebody. Attack away! Don't give him a chance to retaliate. 
Um, excuse me. You are not the advisor. You're the advisor. Um. What? I could have sworn I just saw Dorothea on the screen, and I was very confused. Clearly, I am just going crazy. Wait, hold on. Somebody break? Somebody ready for a crit? No? That's fine. I can change that. Goodbye. Hello, advisor. Ah, oh, yes, I love corners. <laughs> okay, you go ahead and just start working on this stronghold, Captain. Every time I go on what location? I'm thrown into another battle. It's a vicious cycle. You fight with much beauty, Dorothea. Okay, not that one. Is the one down here? Let's clear it out. What location? Is it, is, it, is, it, is it this location? What is this location? Okay, so you specifically need it. Need it. Oh, hi. <laughs> oh, yes, I love not being able to see what I'm getting because I'm hitting so many enemies at once. Oh, I love AoE. <laughs> Are you gonna run along now and start doing stuff, or no? I'm getting better, but at what cost? Did I meet your expectations? Okay, I'm going to start going now. And then I'm going to do this. Because it's kind of struggling. No, no, no. Stop. Oh, too bad. He told you you get to have your special attack. Because they were wrong. Come on, buddy. There we go. That's what I thought. Retreat. He's in trouble. Shamir is always in trouble. Okay, come on, buddy. I was gonna say, I better get this one brawler.
Oh, and she's not healing. Okay. Okay, ho 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 There's multiple problems here. You can go and do that. You go and do that. Okay, we got a healing pot down there. Where, where is it? There it is. Okay. So at least a decent chunk. No, 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 that's not what we're doing here. But that does that doesn't count. You don't you don't get to do that. Okay, there's that. We're done for. The rest is up to you. Come on, Pegasus Knight. Where are you going? Thank you. You don't get to go anywhere, bud. You get to stay right there. Okay, now can we call the all-out offensive? Okay, now we can call the all-out offensive. I'm going up. Because potions. Yoink. That's enough for me. No, 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 no. This way, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what is this chaos? No. Look, you ready? I can do it again. <laughs> and since we perfectly positioned ourselves in the corner, not only can we not see anything, we also still are able to face outwards enough to get all the enemies. <laughs> Okay, buddy. Goodbye. Oh. Okay, nope, never mind. Made a mistake. I'll admit, I made a mistake there. But that was not a mistake. Peace awaits us. I know it does. Wow, we actually got an ass on damage taken? Wow. I guess Shamir just has such low health that it didn't take up much of the max health pool. Good, 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 good.
Battle rank. Uh, we have to get S. Okay. Ooh. Let's go with the Abyssal Tome. Nun who was once very famous, you asked her to join your army, but she refused. They allow me to pray for your safety. Okay. Let's select a unit to raise our magic. Oh, 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 oh. 42, 48, 34, uh, 32, 43, 41. Okay, um, you have 39. And someone who is 10 levels above you, Dorothea, has 34. That's a little sad. Let's return to camp. Let's fix some stuff up. Then we'll go again. Okay, award first. No, excuse me. Um, Supply master first. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Um, I think, actually, never mind. I don't know what we're doing, so. Reward Master. Well, how'd it go? We all have feathers, okay. I need to go and use all my stat increasing items as well. Allow me to assist with any matters regarding the facilities. The creation, huh? Hey, let's visit the forest. <laughs> it took us long enough. Let me know if I may be of further service. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's start using a ton of our start. Let's go ahead and use just a bunch of these. Increases max HP by 1,000. Um, I'm just going to give it one to Edelgard because tank and one to Ferdinand because tank. Strength by five. Um, Edelgard... Ferdinand, Edelgard actually, and then, so 39, 39, 32, now it's 37. Early increases magic by 5, Dorothea. Strength by 2, Petra. Early increases magic by 2. Um, Linhart, Dorothea, Monica. How many of those did I have? Dex by two, that's just gonna be right at a... Um, speed by two, Petra. Luck by two, probably more Bernadetta. Defense by two, Edelgard, Ferdinand, Ferdinand. Runner Reds by two, Linhart, Linhart, and then Marianne. Charm by two, Dorothea. I think she actually has a charm increasing weapon, if I recall correctly, so that's just kind of why I did that. Currently increases HP by 200. Uh, Edelgard, I guess. Okay. I said that he wants to go on an expedition. Um, I want to check one more thing. I want to see if I can buy any more seals. Come back soon. I carry a little of everything here. And no. Hope to see you again soon. Okay, let's find Lysithia. There we go. Shall you be the first one we bring to the forest? Go to the forest. Things are a lot simpler with you. 
I mean that in a good way. I was about to ask, is that a compliment? <laughs> It's not your horses at the mouth of an expansive forest. A natural scene plays across your senses. And you feel at true peace. The air here is so clear. It feels like it could even cleanse the corruption within me. If you were literally anybody else, I would probably call it edgy. You are, I think, one of them. To one of two people who are probably allowed to say that without it actually being edgy. Oh, that's cool. You actually pulled tea. I don't think I've ever sat on the screen for long enough. I find the mercenary lifestyle fascinating. It's a world that's so far removed from my own. Freedom, but also danger. Teach her if she wants. Not, not a world to just peek into. There's freedom, but there's also danger. I think we say both sides of it. I see. For the life of me, I can't understand people who only want to talk about love during a time like this. Very childish. No, that's gonna that's gonna get me killed. <laughs> she would she would just stab me and go, "Oh no, a giant beast." Anyway, moving on. <laughs> Because they're facing death. Agree. I mean, yeah, agree. Right. You, okay, apparently you wanted something more than just... Okay. Um, asking dreams about the future is probably not the right question to ask. Um, what do you like doing? I like can... Uh, canopies. Yes, tree canopies are just so lush. Don't you agree? Okay, so you like candy. Call her out. I'm gonna call her out. I don't even care if this gets me the bad answer. I'm calling her out. <laughs> it's been a while since I've been able to relax like that. It wasn't half bad. I know that was the bad answer, but I was okay with it. If it was the perfect thing, I probably would have gone for the perfect answer, but we already screwed up one of them. It's fine. Okay, um, we got one tome, so let's see what that even does. Price of power. When HP is at 50% or above, critical hit rate is greatly increased, but attacking causes the unit to sustain damage for a period of time. This also has resistance factor. Our other healer type person is you. You have a luck factor on that. So let's schedule this and let's see how it goes. And then you also got some stuff instead of a uh, break shot. Um, let's see. Oh, we finally got flame volley. Okay, okay. But we also got tornado shot. Um, why don't we get Flame Volley there, and then on this one, instead of Point Blank Volley, we're going to go with Tornado Shot. Let's do that. Uh, I think we need another set of Empire Champions. You'll be fine for now. None of that stuff is going to help you out there. Just going to make sure this this is strike with the right timing to yeah, and you attack supplies. Okay, let's do that battle again and just literally just be a bit faster. Otherwise, nothing else needs to change. Just be faster. Okay. 
save. And then fight. I'm just doing what Leave this one to me. That's my First things first. We want to seize. I've got it. And then we want you to seize. Do you want me to lay an ambush? Hello there. Yep, 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 yep. That's not the gate. That's the gate. Looks like we got a live one. Time to get in there and fight. Please, it is this a leave this one to that witness our valiant efforts. And now we're good. Now I simply go here and go wee. <laughs> Got you, as well as it appears a couple others. More for you two, specifically the Stronghold Captain. Don't really need to mess with anyone else outside of the base. But you guys are not done with that yet. Oh boy, that really caused you to take, like, a lot of damage. Not a main mission, so I shall leave it be. Every time I grow stronger, I'm thrown into another battle. It's a vicious cycle. That was amazing. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Don't do that. Okay. Okay, so we got that. Go ahead and start checking out the archers. A strength up. Just making sure. 20% damage taken. Okay. Let me go ahead and do this.
Position secure. How are they all doing here? Please, is this a leave this one to me? That I say, did I even get all of them? I'm just gonna keep making sure. Instant we hit that 500 enemies defeated, I am I, I'm out of there. Achoo. There's another chunk. 457. Um. Fight there. Excuse me. Um, go fight there, I guess. You fight brilliantly, Petra. It's like you're gliding on air up there. You shall pay for this, you hear. Okay, there's a massive group outside here. I'm gonna go and just wreak some havoc over here. There we go. How many are we at? 42. And we're still doing okay on everything else, right? Okay. Okay, 496. We'll be good if we just do this. This should be it. There we go. That was good. I'm taking that tone off of Marianne. There we go. There is an S rank. Premium Magic Herbs. I'm with your level up, Shamir. This will make things easier. I never realized just how itty bitty your stats were. Witness Bridget Pride. For Bridget, I find strength to carry on. Alright, alright. Don't really care about any of this. I just care that we got the S rank and now we can go and get that one little spot on the map. Hard mercenary lives here. He's willing to train with you. That's so. Anyone who's proven themselves on the battlefield. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, first things first. Go into the convoy. Scroll down to Marion. And this is now the exorcist home. As much as I love that massive crit rate. Uh, I can't sustain that level of damage. I'm lucky that that kind of damage wasn't counted against me. Um, I don't need that. 
There's something that I would like to do over here, though, and let's double check and make sure I don't have anything that I can teach. My instruction comes at a high price. Group session. Yes. Stupid expensive, but okay. Training can be the difference between victory and defeat. And we'll just do it. Where one struggles, two often prevail. Okay, so basically nothing happened there. But didn't know. Proper training, you'll be unstoppable. Care to make yourself useful? And here, um. Sure, let's organize documents. Let's see who needs what here. Um, sure, let's have Lysithia and Monica. Why not? Also, I'm going to go and give those premium magic herbs to uh, Monica because her magic is a little low as well. I will join you. I'll do the best I can. We all must do our fair share. Do this, not that. I'm gonna do this, this, and Monica. There we go. Now it's up to 40. Now it's up to par with everyone else. Okay, and that should be everything. So now we're gonna head to the warm up. And we're gonna end the chapter. Just making sure that there is nothing else. Okay. Subjugation of the Western Kingdom. We'll soon arrive at Baron Mateus's lands. Once we claim them, all of Western Fargus, roughly one third of the kingdom's territory, will be under the rule of the Empire. House Mateus was demoted from a viscountcy to a baronage for their part in some sort of revolt. The current Baron Mateus, whose father was the previous lord, is hardly the most loyal subject of the crown. Removing him from the picture should be a simple matter. Fair enough. However, the kingdom has sent the Baron help in the form of the former Duke Fraldarius, who they call ah. the Shield of Fargus. He looks his father. So long as he holds authority here, we won't be able to break their soldier solidarity. Rodrigue is Felix's father, right? That's unfortunate. Not like they really got along in the first place. Don't but... get me wrong, I'll fight whoever I need to. It just feels like we're pitted against familiar faces every time we turn around. And that isn't all. Our reports indicate the enemy has hired Gerald's mercenaries. We know from personal experience how formidable those foes can be. The Ashen Demon again. Say, that reminds me. What are you planning to do about that exactly? We're gonna win again. We can't keep letting one mercenary mess with our whole army. So just watch. I'm gonna take that monster out once and for all. Or at least slow them down, if nothing else. That hesitance doesn't suit you. Not anymore. You're far stronger than the last time your paths crossed. Just say the words and I'll give you all the power I can muster. We will prevail. I possess skill at leading surprise attacks, and Bernadetta would be making a good decoy. <laughs> no, make Bernadetta a decoy. If we are all working together. We will reach our goal with much ease. I get a say in this whole decoy plan, right? Apparently not. I was only saying a fact, not asking you to be doing it. Please accept my apologies. Oh, okay. I hope you plan to leave some of the enemy for me. You are all so skilled. I often feel like the fifth wheel on a well-crafted carriage. 
Don't downplay your talents, Ferdinand. You give us courage every time we step on the field. I'm lucky to be surrounded by so many gifted leaders. With all of you at my side, there is no limit to what the Empire might achieve in the years to come. Victory to the Empire! Yay! Then, to battle again. Come on, Arval. Seriously? Right now? You can't drag me off to sleep like this when the battle's about to start. Sorry, but we need to talk. Do you remember the warning I once gave you? Well, I've been struck by a similar premonition now. Something feels wrong. Very wrong. We're gonna have to deal with so this again. The Ashen Demon showed up and nearly sent me to an early grave. Yeah, you aren't fighting the Ashen Demon anymore, you're fighting so this. Thing's gonna happen today. Hard to say for sure. But the feeling's worse this time around. Stronger. So if I had to guess, I'd say they're on the cusp of something terrible. An act far more dangerous than we previously imagined. Well, whatever's happening, I'm just gonna have to stop it. So long as you don't put yourself in any unnecessary danger, yes. Remember, your death would cut both of our destinies far too short. Defeat Roderick! No defeat conditions? Your actions in this battle will greatly impact- Huh? I was not told about this until now. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, we definitely want to persuade. Okay, resonant lightning strategy will significantly turn the tide of battle. It's going to have HP restored while in allied strongholds. Slightly weaken the enemy for a period of time by demoralizing them at the start of battle. We're going to battle with additional strongholds secured. Grant sword biker to stronghold captains. We can almost do all of them. So we can get these three and nothing else. Or we can do two of them plus recovery boost. Or one of them plus resonant lightning. I don't know what my decisions are in this case. So I'm going to use resonant lightning. And then... False rumors, I guess? I really don't know what my decisions are in this battle. Okay, who are we fighting? A lot of swords, axes, and bows. So we can deal with the... Or, excuse me. Yeah, swords, axes, and bows, plus a little bit of other stuff. Um, mostly infantry, decent chunk of heavy, with some cavalry and lances mixed in there. Okay, so sword, going to be Ferdinand. He's already there, so there he is. This war is ours to be won. Now, as for archery stuff, um, we have Marianne here. Shamir, uh, no. Why can't you just let <laughs> me stay inside? Okay, um, you're gonna be good against. That, uh, we're so you. You're gonna be good against the archers again. You're gonna be good against uh, axes. You're gonna be good against cavalry, which will probably involve spears. Um, actually, you know what? I can we can all handle the uh, that pretty well. Um, Kaspar, you're motivated, so you're just gonna be an adjutant to someone. Um, who else is motivated right now? All this, don't need all this. Um, Bernadetta, as for you, I'm sorry, but no. I'm thinking why Scythia? Hmm. 
Mm, no, not Lysithia. Perhaps Dorothea. Dorothea's already out there. Um, okay, I truly don't know. Bernadette is fine. What Bernadette? Er. I'll get Monica in there. Well, Monica or... Sorry, I am incredibly indecisive right now. Monica or Lysithia? Sorry about that. Not about this. Hmm. Let's go with Lysithia. I don't think we've had time to mess around with her uh, Theosis because of the uh, upgrade. So we're going to mess around with Theosis just a bit. We'll let her kind of run wild. So here's our here's our strategy here. Save. Apparently, I might want to save in a different slot after this. So if something changes here that I don't like, I can go back. Or because I'm a completionist, I can eventually just go back to this point without having to go and replay the whole game. So. That'll, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll save in this slot. We'll save in another slot afterwards. Our enemy has placed Baron Mateo. Okay, hold on. Okay, sorry about that. It's time to go big brain. It's time to strategize. Okay, so first things first. Um, Kaspar, you're motivated, but uh, you are not going to gain any sort of effectiveness here, so you're going to be an adjutant. Um, Hubert, you're just going to work well with uh, Edelgard. She's going to help against axes. You're going to help against um, uh, cavalry. It's basically the same thing for both of you. It's almost exactly the same thing for... It literally is the same thing for both of you. So, that's fine. Um, as for you, Ferdinand, we'll just... You two make a funny pair, so we'll do that. And then you two make a good pair, so we'll go ahead and do that. Okay, now, as for where everyone is going, I'm going to mess around with um, the Asura... Uh, no, it's not Asura anymore. It is Asura. Asura is the new one. Yes, 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 yes. So, as for where everyone else is going, Please. they're just going to start taking care of some of these starting strongholds. You're going to go there. You don't have any one place in particular that you need to go and take care of. Um, so you're just going to go and take care of someone that you're neutral against. So, we're just going to have you go right there. Actually, no, we're, we're going to have you go on the farther one. So, just you're further out when the time comes that we need to rotate and move. And as for Ferdinand, again, there's nothing he's currently too strong against right now, except for this one stronghold, so he's going to go there, and then he's just going to probably go and assist on one of the two archers. As for me, I'm going to go and capture this stronghold first, and after that I'm going to go and probably assist up here with this archer, and that'll be alongside Ferdinand after I get that done. We have no option but to defeat I really don't like that flash is on the battlefield though. Anything beyond that, however, requires careful consideration. It will take time to ready a path to the shore. Until then, let us begin by attacking the plane to the west. The Empire's here! No! I'm too young to die! Now there's your pitiful oh, yeah. You're the lord of these lands. Show some pride! Oh right, we're on the we're on we're on 
We have five and six now. Um, nothing changed, right? Hold X during any sh any strong attack to change the number of attacks. Okay, so that's why that was going for so long. Let's press and hold. Press X to launch an attack. Uh, if you have two plus sword icons, chain X to change your attack. Okay. Four, five. I see, okay. That's fine, we can deal with that. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh, me likey. Okay, the latter part of this, of this class's combos is so much better. Specifically, I don't like the third one, I think. Yeah, I don't like the third one. It's nice for movement, but that's about it. I'm not sure if that was the purpose or not. Yes, yeah, so a lot or half of these combos, four, five, and six, feel really good. Okay, um, how's Ferdinand doing? Ferdinand says he's done. Okay, so... Go ahead and start attacking some of these other guys. Just kind of start sweeping up around the area. I'm gonna see if I can't carry the sniper into the base here. You're mighty obnoxious here, sniper. I know this battlefield. That's why they made the joke about Bernadetta being a decoy. Because it was literally on this battlefield where it happened if you played um, certain routes. Not all of them. All of them. Okay, that's fine. I can, I can still work with that. Oh, it's the Baron that was doing that. Okay. Uh, okay. How is everyone else doing right here? Okay, um... Sorry, Baron. Uh, you are not my priority. Not right now, at least. No, she's not. She's fine. Um, Edelgard. Here I go. Go and fight the Baron. Okay, I thought it was good. There we go. Good. We've decimated the enemy's forward position. I'm surrounded. I beg you, stay your hand. I happily surrender. Ah, I see. So we could have just. So he could have just died instead. We could have just 
removed him in a different fashion. I must find a way to distinguish myself. Maintain to the northwest and finish that path to the show. I knew the Baron wasn't up to the task. We'll have to forestall the enemy ourselves. Move out and attack. You know what? I just feel like doing this. Get out of here. There they go. Okay. Phase two. We got a couple of swords masters here. We're gonna go ahead and have you go up to the farthest one, as you'll be able to move there just super fast. We do have an archer, so go ahead and do that. Um, still no access to any lance wielding enemies yet, so we're just gonna have you go here and stay away from some of the swords masters, yet still be close. Okay. Um, uh, okay, it might be a slight change of plans. Okay, so we're gonna do this a bit, little bit differently. Sorry, bud. Um, actually, no, we'll be able to go up there pretty quickly, so go ahead and do this. Oh, jeez. What in the world was that? Got it. Oh, you know what? It was a sniper. That's what. Yeah, see, notice how the Swordmaster was probably a much higher strength than the sniper. Hit me with every single one of his, every single hit on that move, and I took barely any damage, and yet one hit from the sniper. Did not realize that they <laughs> they wanted to make those guys so friggin' broken. Um, uh, nope, not there. Oh, Ryan. Help you out in a minute. I like this move a lot. It just carries really well. Gotcha. Yep, goodbye. <laughs> Very nice, Kaspar, very nice. Okay, buddy, now go. There's not a question. Appears all the engineers are safe. Now we can truly make the battle. Now, send your lightning crashing across the battlefield. Oh, perfect. Oh, like don't get involved here, please. Oh, he's a great knight now. Wow, good job, buddy. That is also a tad bit unfortunate, though. I'm going to assist Edelgard on this. You're magic, so you'll hit hard. So good. 
Though I'm prepared for something to go horrifically wrong any minute now. Don't jinx it. I'm all for exercising caution, Lynn, but could you not be such a wet blanket? Oh, this is good. This is good. I love it. Yeah. Funk. Need the paladins and aid random. Okay. Paladins, though. Ooh. Okay. Um. Here I go. Yeah. No, I need you down here. No mistakes. They must learn who they're up against. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and shadow slide. I have an awakening, so I can at the very least go down there and start helping. We can't afford the risk. Let us take them by storm. We will soon control the area. Hello. Good, good, good. Hey, Yuri. I said I'd hand them the victory, and I'm not going to back down now. He's at least a semi If we can pin him down, I'll find him. Hopefully Edelgard's still coming, because I don't know if we still need her or not, but it would probably be good to have her. Yep. Randolph, why weren't you defending Flesh? I feel like that, would, that should be your top priority. Got you. No paladins shall remain on my watch. Look how quickly those regular attacks come out. It's nice. I'm getting stronger. Look at that, that's incredible. Tear through their guard. <laughs> okay, Yuri's right there. We persuaded him, so now we can go do that. Thank you. I wish I had your strength. Please tell me you're not pointing that thing at my beautiful face. Sorry, buddy. Okay, well, I guess we're just letting this rip here. Oh no, the poor one, two soldiers. Oh. <laughs> they did not sign up for that. Oh boy. That's right, you have different stuff now. I forgot, I forgot, I forgot. You're you're using different stuff. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Ah. Come on now. Fine. <laughs> Take it away, noble man. Huh? 
Okay, okay, okay. Now we should eventually be able to just waltz right on through here. Oh boy. Okay, never mind. Uh, everybody needs to come, like, right here, right now. Oh, he's in the Enlightened One's form. Uh, don't like that. Don't like that at all. Don't like it. Don't like it. Don't like it. No, 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 no. I don't like it. Edelgard can stay here, though, because she's going to just be able to sneak up that uh, right-hand side. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 okay. okay, 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 okay. Here I go. No mistakes. Just a paladin, just a paladin, just a paladin. Aloise. Me. They must learn who they're up against. Um please, excuse me. I'm not sure. Yard. This is gonna be a bit rough. Fighting them now. Yep. I have to reach the commander as soon as possible. Not a problem. I've got this. Why is he going down so much easier? Wait. Wait. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Something isn't right here. And now he's going to come back up. No, 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 no. He's going to come back up. He's not done. I can still win this. No. Not again. I have to get out of here. Oh. No, oh, he actually just flat out right left. Okay. Um, in that case... Charge! Be to see the demon sleep. But that erratic behavior concerns me. Is fighting at a what do you mean? He's fighting at a disadvantage. Oh, because they all have rapiers. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got this. <laughs> I got this. Um, you're good there, buddy? How? Boy? There we go. <laughs> um, okay, if they can capture that, then I can just shadow, uh, sneak over, right? Right. Uh, that's not what I want. I want... It'll guard. Man, I freaking love the music. I'm sorry I can't, like, turn it up louder. This is literally about as, I think, as loud as it gets in terms of balancing it all. Okay, buddy. Shez is nearly routed. Hold on. Okay, buddy, we're gonna 
shadow slide you over here. Yoink. Nope. That's what I meant. Why? Well, there. Okay, thank you, Hubert. Appreciate it, buddy. Okay, um. Ferdinand. Swordmaster. Everyone else just kind of. I guess go after the Swordmaster, too. You're gonna go after Aloise. And I'm going to control Chess. That's rude. I bear you no ill will, but it was your choice to come within striking distance. I come carrying reinforcements. Now go and help your comrades. They freaking lied. They lied. They said there would be no flyers, so I took Bernadetta out. Seize it. And that should be it right there. Get Alois in there too. Sorry, Alois. I don't want to do this. Exactly. If you wouldn't mind holding on for just one minute, we appear to have someone with a key, and there is someone with a chest in there. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and go all out offensive here, except I'm going to control Edelgard. Okay, maybe I maybe I don't need an all-out offensive. Uh, how about Chez? I'm here to help. Are you guarding the right person? The Empire will not be in no. not Guard that. Not you go down there and attack. You fight them, I guess. I know I'm probably not going to get S in terms of like the timing and stuff like that, but I want this chest, so. Excuse me, come on there. Ferdinand was actually doing a pretty good job. I, 
Ow. Okay, I was gonna say we don't need to do the full animation. We we just we got it. Okay, so now we can do the all-out offensive here. I'm going to control. I cannot control Shez. Now I can control Shez. Don't mind me, just gonna yoink. Ferdinand, you good there, bud? You seem to be uh, literally running into a wall. I do not have awakening. It's not exactly good. How are you doing there, buddy? I'm just kind of stalling for time until other people show up. But as you. Sorry. Actually, I mean, I'm really not, in all honesty, but you know. No idea what my decisions were during this thing, but oh, apparently we are not done yet. The enemy commander has been defeated. Grant no quarter to any soldiers who refuse to surrender. Ah. I leave to take care of one backup squad and they must come back to this. What a mess. Time to send a few of you to the grave before Rodrigue gets lonely. Well, now we know what happened to our reinforcements. Hi, Gerald. Wait, did that say Felix? No, I could have sworn something said Felix. Hold up. I s I I am apparently seeing things. I'm going crazy or something. I don't know. This. Yes, a demon might have gotten away. You'll make a fine substitute. Stronger folks than you have tried to fail to claim the blade breaker's head. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. I really don't want to do this. I'm honestly surprised that you haven't been inflicted with fire yet, though. That's that's impressive. Get out of 
looks like you f beat me. About time my luck ran out. Guess I'm overdue. The rest is up to you, kid. Wait, no. I defeated the blade breaker. I can't. No. No. Randolph! Don't worry about me. Just go. Hurry. I won't. Please, Flash. <laughs> Randolph, I'm so sorry. You're gone forever, and it's all because of me. It's all my fault. Enough. You know that's not true. But he could have escaped, and instead he stayed behind to protect me. And that's why that... that... thing... In that case, the fault is mine. I had the Ashen Demon cornered and couldn't close the deal. And then Gerald gave me so much trouble that I wasn't able to reach you in time. I could have prevented all this if I'd just been a little quicker, a little better. That's not true. You saved me. That wasn't me. It was Randolph. He gave his life for yours. I know there's nothing I can say that's going to help. So instead, I'll let my sword do the talking. When I cut the Ashen Demon down. You're more than capable of it, too. You had that monster right in your grasp. I only wish my premonition hadn't come true. Gerald's... gone? No. This is all my fault. I let them walk all over me. I left him unprotected. I'm sorry, Captain. I'm so sorry. It is what it is. Mercenaries live short lives. It did not have to be like this. Had you not scorned my strength, your father would yet live. The captain was a true titan among men. I... can't believe he's gone. <sighs> there is a way to solve this woe. Just grant to me your worldly flesh, and vengeance shall be yours. We must now send the whelp that killed your father to an early grave. Do you mind taking command for a while, Heloise? There's something I need to do. Well, yes, of course, but surely I can aid you. No, this task is mine alone. Very well. But don't you dare get yourself killed. <sighs> I don't like that. I...
There's gotta be a way for Geralt to live. For Gerald to live. I won't let myself stop here. No way he has to die in every story. I'm getting who knew this power slept within. Oh, look at that. Long rest of history. Thanks, game. Appreciate that. Okay. Mm. The enemy commander, the former Duke Frog. Don't just go to happy music. Defeated. Now, Mateus territory and all the western lands of Fargus will yield as one to the Empire. Still, this battle came at a far greater cost than we are used to paying. This is the most dead and wounded we have ever faced in a battle. Not to mention the loss of General Randolph. And yet, we might finally be rid of one of the greatest thorns in our collective side. Don't say Gerald. Eliminating Captain oh. Gerald was a masterstroke. I like Gerald. Lucky. His band will fall apart without him. Won't. Or it may throw them into a vengeful fury that makes them stronger and more united than ever. That's what it'll do. That's going to be a problem, especially with the Ashen Demon still roaming the land unchecked. An intriguing figure, that one. And a crest bearer for certain. We'd be smart to step lightly. Guess that explains where all the awesome power is coming from. But the Ashen Demon doesn't strike me as nobility, and only nobles have crests. I'd posit the man standing next to you doesn't exactly exude nobility either. The demon's hair exhibits new color. It is like something from one of Bridget's old stories. One will be chosen by the spirits and granted their protection. And with that protection, great power. Can I just go on the record and say no to vengeance? I have zero interest in being revenged upon. <laughs> That's the risk one takes when entering battle, Bernadetta. Sadly, you can't take up arms and not expect reprisal. We have no control over whether they come for us or not. We can only control what we do next. No way! No one's making me take my medicine! If you insist on continuing to interrupt Her Majesty, Far more immediate things to fear than an enemy's nebulous vengeance. <laughs> Come to think of it, has anyone seen our mercenary friend? I know what I told Flaish, but did I really do the right thing? Of course, you did what no one else could. The Ashen Demon may have escaped, but you got rid of their captain. It was a choice. There's no question. It you was could. a choice. And next time, no. the Ashen Demon. He will, will not die. Fall. No. But so many people died, including Randolph. No, there's some way that we can get around this thing. A price must always be paid for victory. And besides, Randolph is just one man. Well, I think I. Yeah, I just may have given myself a bruise by slamming on my leg so hard. Ow! <laughs> One man who was hand-picked by Edelgard, just like me. One man who shared all of our struggles. He was a good man and a fine ally, and now he's dead because of me. I had no idea you cared so much. All the more reason to finish what you started. 
You can still make this death mean something, and I can give you the strength to do so. Now cheer up! Seeing you sad like this makes me... Makes you what? Yes, it, it makes me very... something. Tight in the chest. Anyway, stop frowning at me. I don't like it. No matter what anyone else tells you, I'm the closest ally you have. Remember, we're partners in destiny. Are you prepared for this? Honestly, I don't know. Gerald wouldn't want this. He didn't believe in vengeance for vengeance's sake. Indeed. You could not be more right. Revenge is not a thing you take for someone else. You seek revenge to slake your rage and heal your wounded heart. I know you are prepared it doesn't to work. do whatever that you must. It doesn't work, me. I could do this by force, you know. Oh, um, so this? Be grateful then that I asked for your leave at all. You're right. This has to come from me. Let's get along real well, so this. Your power. Help me win, no matter what it takes. Ah, yes. You shall make a most worthy vessel after all. And now, behold all that I have discovered at the edge of time. Scarlet Blaze. Heroic Bloodlines. Can I replay that battle? Through a new I just... pact with the Lester Alliance, Edelgard can direct her might at the kingdom, and though it comes at no small price, her forces steadily gain the upper hand. But the kingdom does not stand idly by. Dimitri rallies the Western Lords, led by House Dominic, blood of one of the ten elites in a last-ditch effort to forestall the Empire. No, brother. Anything but that. You cannot force the relic onto Annette. Pressure? Calm yourself. I've nearly bade her wield it, not sent her rushing off into the teeth of the enemy. It's all right, Father. I know I'm the only one who can do this. Just seeing the crest of Dominic and our hero's relic is going to improve everyone's morale. It shames me to thrust this task on you, when it should have fallen to that craven son of mine. Yes, I doubt we can expect Simon to return and wield the relic, considering how quickly he abandoned us. It seems I raised him poorly, yes. I should have taught him how our house managed to survive this long without starving or freezing. Don't look so sad, Uncle. I'll gladly carry the burden until Simon returns. But, Annette... Enough, Father. Stop worrying. After all, this is nothing compared to what the soldiers are going through at the front. So many people are fighting and dying out there. Some of them my good friends. I'm not going to cower in safety while they struggle. Especially when I'm in the best position to help. Forgive me, Annette. If you sense any danger at all, child, promise me that you'll run. I couldn't bear to lose you. I know, Father. So let's just all do the best we can to keep our land safe. The nearer we get to Blathed territory, the more resistance we're likely to face. The lords surrounding the capital are the most loyal to the crown. We have Geraint, Enid, Brennius, and Bellinus. There is no telling whether these houses will choose subjection or destruction. Regardless, we cannot simply ignore them as we attempt to march on the capital. 
We must seize control of each of their lands and establish footholds before continuing on. is still doing everything we expected of them. There are no changes on that front. So as long as we continue tightening the vice around the kingdom, we're certain to fulfill your majesty's goals. Glad to hear it about the Alliance. Does this mean the war will be over soon? I feel some actual motivation coming on. That's good. In that case, I don't. <laughs> nope, nope, never mind. Motivation gone. <laughs> that was a close one, Bernadetta. You almost got yourself assigned to the front lines. <laughs> As for me, you know what to do. Just put me right at the front and let me start wrecking stuff. We shall see who does more wrecking of stuff, Caspar. I will not be letting you outshine me. Watch as I am bringing glory to Bridget and the Empire on the battlefield. I wonder if I'll find someone worth marrying before this war is over. You won't. Of course you will, Dorothea. You're amazing. I need to bring it to you. Enough. But you won't. It's easy to let your guard down when the end is in sight, and we can't fall victim to that. Stay disciplined. And together we will take Fodlin's future in hand. Don't worry, Edelgard. We're ready to get this done. That goes doubly so for me. I must ready myself for the final clash that looms in the coming days. Right then. Let's start by taking care of the enemy in front of us. As a choice, they would not have brought so much attention to it in a separate freaking cutscene if it wasn't a choice to have Gerald live or die. I will redo that battle. I'm going to read lore and then we're going and redoing that battle because Gerald is not dying. I like Gerald too much to have him die in every single freaking timeline. No. <laughs> I wasn't keeping this save file, but hmm. I have the most brilliant idea. Acquire materials to expand the training ground, acquire materials to expand the battalion guild, sell items for a slightly higher price. Training grounds, duh. I'll do what I can. Shall we? Ooh. She has a pretty decent chunk of materials, nice. Okay, great. So we're here. Let's go read lore. I'm not going to even talk to anybody. I'm going to read lore. I'm going to edit the title real quick. There we go. We're now reading lore. Okay, we're going to read lore. And then, we're going back and we're redoing that battle because I am not letting Gerald die. I will find some way to make him live. It has to be a choice. There is no way it is not a choice. They pulled so much attention to that. No freaking way it's not a choice. No way that they weren't going like, feel bad about it. You chose this. Feel bad. You will feel bad. You will feel bad about your choice. There's no way they didn't just do that. No freaking way. <laughs> Okay. Imperial Territories of Adressia Part 2. The directory of information on each region within the Adressian Empire. As it contains no confidential information, it can be viewed and checked, for, checked out freely. 1180 edition. Irving. A county stretching from the Ogma Mountains to the Mock Coast in the west. It contains the Mock Way, which links the Empire east to west with Irving's capital in the center. The city stronghold of Mosgoz. I think I pronounced that correctly. I probably didn't. Though it lacks fertile land compared to the other regions, it boasts abundant natural resources and opportunities for trade. Girth. 
A duchy is situated in the Empire's northmost point. It's known for its relatively cool climate in the Empire. Having assimilated Nouvelle, which fell during the Dagda and Bridget War five years ago, it now encompasses the Empire's westernmost point. The vast plateau in the east is covered in woodlands and should provide opportunities for, for, for future development. Former Arendelle Territory The former Grand Duchy, now under direct imperial control, known for its famous black woods and abundant rivers and lakes. Killinger. A barony. Though cramped and rugged, its terrain boasts precious mineral resources. Ox. A barony located in the northern part of the peninsula known as Fodland's Fangs. The northern plain, the north features plains and rivers with mountains and ports in the south. Diversity of terrain means no industry in particular stands out, and so the region has only seen modest developments. Isar, a viscounty that is notable, for, a viscounty that is notable for its expansive basin surrounded by mountains. Capital is the finest city for academics in the empire, save for Endar. Magical studies have flourished here. Lukin, Lukin, I think that's Lukin. I think. A viscounty known for its wool and textile products, which are come here to the west. To its west, excuse me. Mir, a viscounty known for wool and textile products, much like Lokin, to its east. <laughs> Minja. A viscounty encompasses. I cannot read, I am so sorry. A viscounty encompassing the west of Mott Coast and its many inlets. Boasting a robust fishing industry, it is also one of the largest producers of sea vessels in the Empire. Martin is a newly established barony with few distinctions as yet. And Barnabas, a barony located to the west of Garrick Mach and composed chiefly of rugged mountains and woodland terrain. It's famous for its woodcrafts and orchards. Or, excuse me, orchards. That is orchids at first. That's my bad. That's not what that says. It says orchards. Empire Nobles 2. Register of prominent noble houses of the Adrusian Empire. This document is expressly for the official use by the Church of Saros. Students are forbidden to remove or pursue this documentation. 1179 edition. Too bad we're reading it anyway. House Girth. A house of dukes that has inherited rule over Empire's Ministry of the Exterior. It's diplomacy, foreign relations, and relations between various provinces and the capital fall under its purview. It worked hard to secure the ceasefires that ended both the Bridget and Dogda campaigns. Though complicit, though complicit in the insurrection, he remains distant from the associated houses. House Arundel, formerly a minor noble house of the Empire, its head of the house, when Volkard's younger sister became betrothed to Emperor Ionius IX, Volkard was granted the title of Lord Arundel. Having worked closely with House Iyer, House Arundel is one of the chief in instigators of the Insurrection of the Seven. House Prim is a house of Imperial Viscounts, resisting Emperor Ionius's, Ionius IX's policy of power centralization. It set out to join the Alliance and secure independence from the Empire, but was unable to overcome the Imperial Army's intervention. In the aftermath, the House's main genetic line was wiped out. Its current head of house is an adoptee. House Nouvelle, a house of Imperial Viscounts with territory on the western coast of the Empire, centered around its namesake harbor city of Nouvelle. The house flourished thanks to commerce with Dagda, Albania, Bridget, and other territories. Even still, it fell ruin in 1175 after permitting the combined invading forces of Dagda and Bridget armies to make landfall. Its Ox is a house of Imperial Barons. Its territory occupies the northern half of the western peninsula known as Foden's Fangs. The head of the house was lost to the Dagda and Bridget War. Ox Bartel is a house of Imperial Barons. Highly ambitious, it sought out and acquired several crests for its bloodline. In 1176, many members, including the head of the house, died under unexplained circumstances. The guilt of this tragedy was attributed... Uh, excuse me. The guilt of this tragedy was attributed to the heir, Emil. 
As his whereabouts are unknown, leadership of the house fell to a distant relative. This is the house of Mercedes. Which is interesting, because it's classified as an empire noble. As Emil, the Death Knight. Sorry, I'm trying to make sure that I'm having what I'm saying is correct. Emil, the Death Knight, was the actual heir. Cities belonged to... Where are you not working? Uh kingdom and therefore it's all jumbled and that's why separate sides I'm sorry that was the worst explanation I think I could have possibly given I need to read up again on like that whole family tree thing surprise 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 after many many countless years of history family trees start to get very very big and convoluted Especially when they're talking about bringing in different bloodlines and combining bloodlines and adopting and stuff like that. Turns family trees into something very, very, very convoluted. <laughs> and bringing in politics into it of who's going to be the heir of the house, who belongs to where, and stuff like it. it whack. It's crazy. Traveler's Journal 2. It's a record consistently consisting largely of the world outside Folkland. The author's identity is unknown. They've clearly experiences, experienced these places firsthand. Virgin, an archipelago nestled between Folkland and Dagda. A land of plenty, it is often heralded as the perfect union of the gentle sea and the nature's bounty. But Folkland and Dagda have long vied to claim this territory as their own. Strang was once the name of an enormous peninsula to the north of Folkland. Today, only the northern half has kept the moniker, while the southern half now falls under the, uh, under the dominion of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus. Several warlike clans call this great wasteland their home. Certain areas of the region are comprised of rocky desert. Dusker, a peninsula to the north of Fodland and the west of Srem. People who once inhabited this area were decimated, and it now has followed, uh, excuse me, and it now falls under the dominion of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus. The land boasts nothing noteworthy, noteworthy to make it a desirable travel destination, nor of valuable minerals waiting to be unearthed about. The Ogma Mountains are an enormous mountain range somewhat south of the central Folan. To the west, it forms the border between the Empire and the Kingdom, surrounding Garrig Mach and cutting across the Empire territory. It's home to many animals and plants that cannot be found elsewhere, as well as a plethora of valuable mineral deposits. We have two histories of Odlin, prepared for a lot of lore. History of Odlin 1. Under the tyranny of ruthless disorder, the people who endured a long period of suffering... Excuse me, there is no who there. The people endured a long period of suffering... The vile nemesis, who proclaimed himself the king of liberation, delighted in war and bloodshed. Part of them rebelling against his persecution, the people of Fodland fell to its depths in a mad scramble to attain power through murder and theft. Forty-one years before the founding of the Adrestian Empire, St. Seros appeared in, in the land of Enbar, and through many, the many unfathomable miracles she performed, spread light across the land. In doing so, she joined the shattered hearts of the purest people of Fodlan, who went on to form the Holy Church of Seros. Imperial Year One, Founding of the Adrestian Empire. In the first year of our calendar, the glorious Adrestian Empire was found. Its name was gifted by an oracle, and its future blessed by the goddess. Its capital, Enbar, was chosen to govern the southern reaches of Fodlan where the divine Saint Seros also lent her power. Imperial Year 32, The War of Heroes Wilhelm Paul Hrasvelg, the inaugural Adrestian Emperor, raised an army in pursuit of the unification of Fodland. With his might, he hunted and destroyed any house's territory that dared to seek more power. Imperial Year 46, The Battle at Grondor Field 
an intense battle erupted on, on Grondor Field, where the houses that were allied with Nemesis and the Imperial forces of the Adresian Empire clash. There, the Imperial forces emerged victorious. Imperial Year 91. Battle at Tail Team. The houses of, that were allied with Nemesis once again faced off against the Imperial forces, this time at the Tail Team Plains. There, the evil Nemesis finally fell and the, and the Emperor, Emp I cannot speak, and the Empire secured a momentous vic victory. Imperial Year 98, the War of Heroes ends. The successor to Great Emperor Wilhelm I, like, like him, 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 I'm going with like him, like him the first, Succumbed to sudden illness. The Empire, which ruled over the majority of Fodland, took this opportunity to put an end to its seemingly endless fighting. Part 2 Imperial Year 721, the First Mock War. Dagdan army invaded from across the sea. Though the Imperial forces resisted the attack and drove off the enemy, the land of Mock sustained considerable damage. Imperial Year 728, the invasion of Bridget. The Empire invaded the Bridget Archipelago, a land occupied by the allies of Dagda. As penance for their refusal to surrender, the people of Bridget were relegated to a life of Imperial subjugation. Imperial Year 731, the invasion of Dagda. With the boon of a strong foothold in Bridget, the Empire mounted a large-scale invasion of Dagda. However, the forces of war were not on their side, and their attack failed. In Imperial Year 747, Vargas Rebellion. Lug, a descendant of one of the one of the houses that first quarreled with the Empire, raised an army to demand independence, pulling the land of Fargus into a fierce rebellion. This clash became known as the War of the Eagle and Lion. Imperial Year 751, Founding of the Holy Kingdom. Lug and his resistance army were victorious over the Imperial forces. The Holy Church of Saros mediated between the two, and Fargus secured its hard-won independence as the Holy Kingdom of Fargus. Imperial Year 801, the Leicester Rebellion. A rebellion broke out in the Imperial lands of Leicester, which the Imperial army was unable to suppress. The Holy Kingdom, viewing the uprising as an opportunity to increase its own political sway, occupied the Leicester region, formally declaring it as a territory of Fargus. Imperial Year 681, Argus Divided. Following the death of King Klaus I, three princes became archdukes and split the Holy Kingdom of Argus, that it may rule over it, uh, that it may rule over it as three separate territories. Imperial Year 881, the Crescent Moon War. The Archduke, ruling over the Leicester region of, of the kingdom, succumbed to illness. The Lords of the Leicester Lands refused to acknowledge that the Arch the next Archduke in line, instead plotting to rule jointly as an alliance. Imperial Year 901, the founding of the Alliance. The Leicester Alliance was officially formed after the subjugation of hostile nobles and the removal of all opposing forces in the region of Fargus. An influential physical an influential figure from the outset, Duke Regan, was an arguably the heart of the newly formed alliance. Imperial Year 961. The Almiran invasion. The great eastern nation of, of Almira crossed through Fodland's throat and invaded Alliance territory. The Empire dispatched troops in order to help conquer this threat, and the attackers were just barely driven off. Imperial Year 1101, construction of Fodland's Locket. To defend against future Almiran invasions, the Alliance, the Kingdom, and the Empire joined their efforts and resources to construct the indomitable fort known as Fodland's Locket. And that, along with what we have experienced here, is all of Fodland's major history to date, I think. I guess there's... That, that, yeah, for all of Fodland, that's what it is. There's other specific things that happen in each, in each individual... Um, I think it's country, kingdom, land, territory, I don't know. Because one of them's a kingdom, one of them's an empire, one of them's a, a collection of territories, I don't know. But you know what I mean. Each, uh, 
the Empire has its own special specific stuff. The Think Kingdom has its own special specific stuff, like the Tragedy of Dusker. The Less Lesser Alliance has its own specific stuff. You know, like you know, there's a bunch of different stuff. Okay, looks like two more: Dive the War Journal Expert and Crystallogical Mysteries. Tree Moon, Imperial Year 731. A fleet departed Bridget without incident. Blessed with calm seas, we soon saw the land of Dagger rising up before us. Before a startlingly white beach lay dense and ominous woods. Our information indicated that a settlement should be nearby. There were no signs of people or boats, let alone any sort of structure. We pondered whether to turn our rudder north or south. Suddenly there was a flurry of arrows. The enemy was shooting at us from between the trees. Caught unaware, many men were struck. I rushed to lift my shield. However, I soon realized the arrows lacked in both number and force. The Dagdan army had lost many soldiers in Mach, and then Bridget. They had strength enough to mount a defense of sorts. Perhaps this would be easier than we thought. The third fleet, led by Viscount Hamir's son, was drawn into the inlet. Enemy trap. How could he not have seen it? We had intended to veer around the eastern tip of the cape. But through the fog, we saw there was a coast to the south as well. With nowhere to go, our ships careened into each other. The lead ship was capsizing, seemingly run aground. Before our very eyes, our comrades... He was a flame. What sorcery is this? The flames were like a great serpent, its tongue flickering towards our ships. In the open sea, the enemy fleet surrounded us. None of us can make it home alive if we could not break through somehow. Though, considering how the Emperor will react to our defeat, perhaps it would be best to die here anyway. Still, we cannot abandon our pride. Bridget has turned on us and sunk half our ships that attempted to dock in their port. It pains me to say that all we can do now is run. Bridget only threw in with us after Dagda's losses. Now that the tide has turned, they've thrown in with Dagda again. Savage Islanders. Their king never intended to honor our agreement for a second. We should have. I've seen it well. Nouvelle. We live to tell the tale. We turn with less than tenth of the ships we set sail from Gingung with. Gingung with. I'm sorry, I misread that name. We were well and truly decimated. It's more, we've lost Bridget as an ally. The Dogdens are truly fearsome. They dance in the air and set fire to the sea. One moment they frolic in the woods, the next you see their fangs. Just what are they? Scary stuff. Last but not least, Crestological Mysteries. Excuse me while I take a drink real quick. Chapter 13. Crest of the Beast. Oh, Maurice's Crest. Also known as Maurice's... Okay, well, thanks. That's the uh, Crest that Marianne has. According to legend... It was held by Maurice, one of the eleven clan leaders who followed Nemesis more than 1,000 years ago. Maurice was a fearsome warrior who, as a young man, felled a giant wolf with just a sword. He was called a hero in his clan, and soon defeated his father to take over as leader. We don't know exactly when Maurice received the crest. One theory is that it was after he swore to fight for Nemesis, who had just defeated him in single combat. Or it could be that hero's relic of Lutgong, he received from Nemesis, answered his subconscious call for aid when he came face to face with an evil presence. Either way, the sword in hand. The Imperial Army. Maurice and Blutgong became a beast of calamity. His sword was made to end lives, mounted and flying enemies made for particularly good targets. A race rampaged through the battlefield, killing many enemy generals and finally a holy warrior. Stoked in blood, he was said to be feared by enemy and ally alike. After the battle at Grandor Field, the war front moved north and Maurice became increasingly unhinged. It is unclear what caused this. One day, after destroying an enemy camp, he simply disappeared. 
North of the battlefield lay a vast misty wood, known as the Enchanted Forces of Mysia. 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 No soldiers sent in to search ever returned. The crest of the beast was inherited by the wild oats sown by Maurice and his sons. They lived on in the shadows of various clans and families, and in particular lords who bore a grudge against the Empire. Or that it became known as someone possesses that someone possesses detestable crest, they would suddenly fall ill or meet their end to an untimely accident. Inevitably, the crest, the crest became an unspoke curse. An unspoken curse, excuse me. And that is all of our lore. With this, I'm not ending, but I'm saving. And I'm now going to load. Hold on, first I'm going to save one more time because I just want to make sure. Save. Okay, now I want to load. I want to load this. I just want to see what the choices are. That's all I want to do. I want to make it so any optional death does not happen. This includes Geralt. Geralt will not die. No way I am letting him die. Back the the sword. There's no way that there's no way that Gerald that Gerald's life is not the significant part of this story. Whether or not the little Duke surrenders to us or if he dies, I don't think that's so significant to alter the course of the entire story. He's a he has a generic model. No way he's gonna do anything. Whether or not Rodrigue lives or dies is possibly something, but I'm not quite sure. As for what we can do, I'm not quite sure. Let's stick with Resident Lightning. It's gotta be something that we can do while interacting with Gerald while he's out there. There's actually one last thing I wanna do. I wanna to return to the war map. Let's make sure that we didn't miss any sort of strategies or stuff like that involved. Convince Gerald to not die. Mm. Got resonant lightning from that. Recovery boost. Okay. Link. There we go. No longer reading war. Um, we aren't saving. Resident Lightning, Persuade Yuri. Sure, let's go with Built Up this time. Okay, good, 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 and good. Um, Caspar was motivated. Um, I think instead of Lysithia? Now we're going to put Bernadetta. Okay. We're changing the outcome. Gerald is living. Our enemy has placed I will make it so. Same shtick as last time. What should I be doing again? 
Need a hand? It's Bernie's time to shine. Well, I'm gonna help, okay? Right then. Let us go to. Shall we join? Front. Here I go. No mistake. Start working here. They must learn who they're up against. Please, excuse me. Is this okay? There is not a question. In the stronghold up here. Leave this to me. While Gerald's mercenaries are over with the main position. We have no option but to defeat the enemy commander, Rodri. Anything beyond that, however, requires careful consideration. It will take time to ready a path to the shore. Until then, let us begin by attacking the plane to the west. The Empire's here! No! I'm too young to die! So... There's a pitiful man. You're the lord of these lands. Show some pride! Shore up your defenses! Do not permit the enemy to break through! If we take down the stronghold surrounding the we might convince them to lay down their defenses. Okay, so my idea is defeating myself, defeating Star, defeating Bylas, whatever you want to call him, defeating the Ashen Demon. I think that might have a part in whether or not Gerald lives or dies. I think that may be it. That's all I can think of that would run differently. We didn't get any sort of input or whatever to... As to... There he is. I was like, where did he go? Where did he land? Where's that? So we're going to cut him off still prevent him from showing up as uh, reinforcements. Um, so we are going to end up just capturing all this. I know I said I did, it didn't really matter whether or not uh, this guy lived or died, but in this case, he'll, he'll destroy the bridge, which will make it so we don't really have to deal with him. Are being nice before, Caspar? Bernan sees that. You good there, Marianne? I can't believe it's come to this. Oh, Marianne. Okay, that wasn't quite right. Two, am I not counting this right? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, that certainly doesn't help. That works too. Okay, buddy. I'll leave you now. I'm just gonna send you here because that's where the guy's gonna appear. Here I go. No mistakes. Start working on that. You go ahead and start working up here. Continue to the northwest and finish that path to the shore. I knew the Baron wasn't up to the task. We'll have the 
forestall the enemy ourselves. Move out and attack. We've been sorcery engineers in this area. Oh, the way, did we get it? It looks like we did. Okay. Yep, there we go. Oh, well, we gotta wait for the ones to be marked. Okay, there we go. Now, now we're good. There we go. That's the one that we want. Gotcha. That includes the Swordmaster. Okay, rude. Fine then. Mortal struggle. Gotcha. That should be all of them, right? No, not quite all of them. Not with all of them. Okay. Thanks for the rescue. I see you there, but not you. Gotcha. Okay, the strategy of this battle wasn't really too hard. It's just trying to figure out what in the world... I'm really hoping that I'm correct and it comes down to... Uh, what not we defeat the Ashen Demon. Did it. There goes the captain. This sounds like a job for Alois. I will capture this stronghold. Let's do this. No. Yeah. So far, so good. There is not a question. Leave this to me. Please. So doing that. And there we go. Never mind, Ferdinand, you don't need to do that. Okay, here's the deal. Here I go. No mistakes. They must learn who they're up against. And then you're just going to sit here for a moment because Yuri's going to appear there. And we want a shadow slide. And this was our extra little stronghold. An enemy detachment from the rear? Hello. Oh, we didn't quite get all of them. That's fine, though. Go. No, 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 no. You get away from flesh. Flesh? Flesh? I don't exactly... I can never pronounce her name correctly. Goodbye. 
soon control the area. Got you. I know they said got you, but uh, it seems to be the other way around, doesn't it? And right here, and that should get all of them. One, two, three. I was going to say, I don't think I can control. So we're just going to let this rip. Okay, both you two just kind of stay here. Magic should do pretty well against you. Yeah, it... There we go. Okay, now I take control of Ferdinand. And I begin sending Marianne down here as well. Aloysius' reinforcements have arrived. Might you go help our soldiers in the Northwest, young mercenary? Consider it done. I'm at the wrong one, aren't I? I said I'd hand them the victory, and I'm not going to back down now. He's at least semi-reasonable. If we can pin him down, I think he'll listen. All right, buddy. Please tell me you're not pointing that thing at my beautiful face. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go, that's what I wanted. Are you sure about that? I've heard of you, Yuri. Perhaps we can forge a new arrangement that benefits us both. Well, when you put it that way. I guess I would prefer not to get butchered. I must stop the enemy here. We've cleared a way to the shoal. We can attack from the east now. Okay. Fine. New orders. There is not a question of can. Only a matter of will. Uh, Ferdinand, you're staying down here. Marianne, I think you're also staying down here. Um, as for Edelgard... They must look me. Form a pincer and bear down on Roderick's position from both sides. I won't last long trying to hold them off from two directions. Roderick's in danger. They'd better go back. I have to convince the Empire I'm worth keeping around. Destroy the bridge and cut the mercenaries off from the main force! Bridge. I can't get back to Rodrigue. Rodrigue has been cut off. Move in and strike before the mercenaries can rejoin him. Oi, 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 oi. You two need to stay down here. I'm not sure I'll be much. There's not a. No, this is our chance to kill the Ashen Demon. There's no one to interfere. I'm sorry, but we're choosing something else. I have to reach the commander as soon as possible. Question, can I know? None of your names shall pass. Not a moment too soon. Let's show them the steel fog this is made 
Is it open? Is this open now? No, it is not. Please, excuse me. You know, hold on. First, um, unassigned adjutant. There is not a question of can, only a matter of will. You shall not pass, indeed. <laughs> Okay, how am I going to do this? So, welcome to the stream, by the way. Um, we're currently trying to rewrite history that happened like an hour ago. Uh, <laughs> okay, so we need to stop the reinforcements. You can take care of that. When you get unassigned, Bernadette is going to... Good to see you? Yeah, thanks. Thank you. Um... Okay, so when you unassigned, it means Bernadette is going to come out. She's going to be an archer. She can take down the Pegasus tonight. Who's sitting in this stronghold, and therefore that'll stop the reinforcements much earlier. When those reinforcements are stopped, I believe that opens up Roderick. I don't know if Alois needs to be defeated first. Okay, so now that they're unassigned, go here and start doing that. Um, you're just gonna stick with Ferdinand for the moment. Actually, no. Um, you go with, because then I need to be in control for after the key is obtained, I need to get the chest. Oh, I didn't dodge far enough. Okay, she is striking. That's what that said. Okay. Alois is a no difficult opponent. I'm not worried about it. You're lucky I'm going easy on you, Alois. You were literally dead the last time you said that. Your HP reached zero mid sentence. Yeah, we're fine. I know we are. What do you mean, Edelgard's in trouble? Okay, fine. I guess I gotta defeat Alois. There we go. Okay, it did say main mission, so I kinda had to. Okay, activate Mortal Struggle. Ah, oh, son of a... I didn't get him. He literally just dodged that. Oh, that's not good. Alright, buddy. Not you. You. Activate Mortal Struggle again. Oh, now it registers him as... I'm ahead of myself. You must be eager to die. The same for you. Goodbye. Let's make a scene. Perfect dodge right into a warrior special. If this doesn't do like at least half of his health bar, double warrior special with that. If this doesn't do at least half of his health bar, I'm gonna be disappointed. I am disappointed. I'm taking as many of you down as I can. stopping the demon. Oh, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Don't worry about it. I'm saving Gerald this time. I freaking hope that's how it... Okay. Uh, pair back up. You stay here. The instant that's done, we can go in, we can grab the silver shield. No, you won't. No, you won't. Oh, okay. Um... 
Fine, so be it. Are you more powerful now? Guess we'll have to find out. Oh, maybe Gerald doesn't come out because Roger can die. Come on, buddy, come on. Oh yeah, you're taking a lot more damage to go down this time. Gotcha. Your sword wasn't even glowing when we fought you in the other time. Okay, so yeah, something is something different is happening here. Especially because Roderick, I don't think is I don't think Roderick's gonna die. You gotta tell me something? What's that? Welcome back, by the way. Oh boy. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I gotta break it. Nice, Gaspar. I don't have Mortal Coil, unfortunately. Yeah, I know. Don't worry. <laughs> We're all weird in this family. <laughs> there we go. Okay. So now with him defeated in that way. Was the same dialogue. Oh, now we get into this back stronghold. Ah. Okay, okay, okay. Hello, Roderick. Eh? Go oh, wait, where are you going? Come on, come on. Buddy, all I need is one warrior special. That's all I need. Okay. I didn't see anything pop up. It's not over yet. That doesn't instill a ton of confidence here. The enemy commander has been defeated. Grant no quarter to any soldiers who refuse to surrender. Not Gerald. Not Gerald. Leave to take care of one Fudge, one. it's Gerald. Come back to this? What a mess. Time to send a few of you to the I don't want to fight slowly. Gerald. Uh, something had an awakening potion. Just had an awakening. Oh, uh, but I cannot speak. I have an awakening potion here. Maybe it's better this way. I mean, it's good that you got magic. We can always deal more damage. Okay, buddy, where are you? That's my trip to South Korea. It was good. Good, I had a ton of fun. Monkey jungle, so many soldiers. Yeah. Stronger folks than you have tried and failed to claim the blade breaker's head. Do I like anime? I do. Welcome to the stream, by the way. 
Uh, oh, hey, Marianne. <laughs> you can grab the chest now. There you go. You don't need a guard anymore. <laughs> Send all orders. Okay. Ah, uh, what end am I still like? Um, I like just about anything, in all honesty. Um, I don't know. I I like a bit of everything. I'm also weird because I'm I have some really weird niche stuff that some people like have never even heard of, and then I've also like the most mainstream of animes out there. Like, I like SAO. I do. I, I know people don't like me for saying that, but I do like SAO. And... Come on, Gerald. Do something. Um, but I also like stuff like The Ancient Maid's Bride and Tony Call Over the Moon for you. I like My Hero Academia. I like... Uh, the recovery of, a, of an MMO junkie. I... I'm all over the place for my tastes. Three zero attack on Titan. So what are some other ones that I watched? Kill a kill. Kill a kill is funny. Um, <laughs> Gerald, buddy, please. I don't want to kill you a second time. It's no way for me. Monkey's uncle. Oh. I'm I, I'm afraid I've never heard that phrase. Okay, buddy. What am I currently watching? At the current moment, I haven't been watching much. Um, there's been nothing really on my priority list. I eventually want to go and watch uh, Spy Family, or Spy Cross Family, or whatever you want to call it. Um, let's see, what else is currently on my watch list? I believe... Um, oh yeah, I still need to watch the, uh, the Red Light District arc of, uh, Demon Slayer. I think My Hero Academia came out with a new season, so I probably need to go and watch that too. I'm behind on a lot of stuff. Time I spent, uh in South Korea. I don't know if you know me personally or not, or if you've seen any of my past stuff, but um, I spent a certain amount of time in South Korea for an internship, and that time would have been when uh, I would catch up on a lot of stuff, because I, I chose to spend a vacation working a tent, essentially. Um, uh, I really stepped in it there. You got strength in defense. That's all I want, Kaspar. Come on, Gerald. Or Lloyd finds out yet. Lloyd finds out. Lloyd finds out. I don't think so. No. I can't quite think of what you're referencing, so I'm gonna assume no, I haven't. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. You can run. I'm intentionally being slow. Well. No, please. I know you can survive this. No, 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 not now. Oh, son of a... Oh, no, 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 no. Anya reminds. Oh, good job, Sola. Um... No, that's for sure, no. <laughs> um, if you're talking about the Spy family, that would explain why I didn't recognize anything. I have not even seen uh, the first episode yet. Buddy, you don't have to do this. You really don't. I'm going to get you... Oh, no, it's all good, don't worry. You 
Is anyway? I sure hope not. That was the whole purpose of why I did this. I intentionally went and took an entirely separate route on how to beat this battle, and yet he's still here, and I really don't want this. Come on, buddy. Girl, please. Is there really no, no other way I can do this? Eh, I don't want to do this. I may just need to look up if this is even a possible choice. I don't want to, because this is my first playthrough, but... If Geralt isn't a choice, then I have no idea what it could be. Also, why are all of my particle effects gone? Hello, game? Why are all the effects gone? Yeah, why am I invisible when I dash? What? Game? Well, uh... I guess I'm spooky. <laughs> Geralt, I don't want to do this, but it appears I have to. You aren't... I'm sorry, buddy. this okay I'm looking it up what in the world is the choice of this like you finally beat me. About time my luck ran out. Guess I'm overdue. The rest is up to you, kid. I defeated the Blade Breaker. I can't believe it. I just want the final battle. I don't need the whole chapter. I got through the whole chapter. Randolph! Don't worry about me. Just go. Hurry. I won't. Please, Flesh. No! How, how could you? You monster! Hey! This cutscene isn't going any differently. not true but he could have escaped and instead he stayed behind to protect me and that's why that that thing <laughs> in that case the fault is mine oh gosh dang it i had the right idea i was just too slow and then Gerald gave me so much trouble that I wasn't able to reach you in time. Ah, okay, sorry, I'm skipping this. We've seen it before. Okay. 
So that explains where my particle effects went. Um, excuse me for one second. I'm going to switch screens because I don't know how much information it's going to show once I click share. I'm going to click share because developer stuff is needed. Okay, sorry about this. Okay, I think we saved. <laughs> okay, here we go. Now we should be good. Oh my god, I can't believe I was too freaking slow. I ha I literally did everything correct, except I was half a second too slow at defeating Roderick. That was it. Okay. That in. Can't believe that was the cause. Half a second too slow. He had no freaking health. If I hit him just like two more times, he would have. He would have went bye bye. And. Uh, ah. okay. Continue. Not this one. Back to chapter ten. Gerald isn't going to die, because I refuse. Absolutely refuse. It's in this battle. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Um. What can we do? I don't know. This stuff affects the late game, does it? Recovery boost is just while in allied strongholds. We aren't going to be in within allied strongholds. Um, built up does create an allied stronghold, which I guess allows us to. Oh, see now you can you can kind of sort of see it. I'm pointing at the screen as if you can see me, um, but you can see the little stronghold there and not there whenever I do this. Okay, so we're going to do that. Um, hold on, I did choose the strategies, right? It, it, yes, okay. Oh, we, uh, no, okay, I don't, I clearly have no idea what I'm doing. But Scythia doesn't need to be here, it's Bernadetta now. Uh, I think I'm just going to have Marianne and Bernadetta run separately. And just have them attack together. Um, that's what I'm going to do for now, to make it a bit easier in terms of organizing who's doing what, who's fighting what. Well, at the start, we'll do this because there's no flyers yet. But after we get into phase two of this battle, we're going to separate them and have uh, Bernadetta at least run back. Marianne can go do whatever she's doing. But Okay, I uh, forgot to go and do the second. Step of the orders. Let's actually send them. No mistakes. They must learn who they're up against. Please. Okay. Round three. <laughs> hey, look, particle. We have no option but to Oh, I am so sorry. I did not mean to show off crashing software. Something tells me it's literally just because I stalled for so much time in that battle that something leaked, something went into overflow. There was probably a particle count or something like that that I paused to go into overflow because I stalled for too long. Please, that's I, I just I just want the crit. That's that's all. I <laughs> Okay, Gerald is not dying. Not today. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're fine. Sorry, buddy, but you, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Onwards we go. I'm bringing it down. Who are these wimps? Can't believe I had the right idea, but I did it too slow. Come on, buddy. There you go. That's the crit meter. Get over here. Uh, I don't need to use any combat arts against this guy. Oh, come on, come on. 
There we go. There's that. Anyone mind if I hide out one of these? I'm gonna go help Marianne. Okay, rude, I thought you were frozen. Oh wait, why am I going this way? I need to go this way. Surrounded. I beg you, stay your hand! I happily surrender! Casper, did I not? Oh, I assigned you to defend, not as in his adjutant. Okay, that that might have been why some of that stuff took a couple seconds longer than I really expected to. The Emperor's roster shames the rest of us. Okay, Edelgard, you're just gonna chill out down here for a little bit. You really aren't gonna do much while you're up here. You're gonna go and just go ahead and fight this guy for a moment. Hold on, I'm dealing with the stronghold, Captain. Okay, you want to be fighting this one? Good. Perfect. Okay. I knew this had something significant. Never. Bonk. Okay, rude. Fine, fine, fine. If you're gonna be rude, try and third party me. <laughs> I bring in my own third party. Like it's a 2v2. Are you boots? Thanks for the rescue. Good ratings, sword master. Get juggled, boy. <laughs> Go. There we go. There's that. There's not a question. Uh, where's the strong one? No, I don't want to guard. There's not a question of care. Only a matter of Fine. I'm over here now. Okay, there, there, there's the. There's not a question of can't leap. Now we can truly make the battlefield. There's that, and now we get to move quickly. Now, send your lightning crashing across the battlefield. Just like that. There goes half of their health. We're perfecting this. Ow. Yeah. 
to this stronghold. So far, so good. So I'm prepared for something to go. Goodbye. I'm all for exercising caution, Lynn, but could you not be such a wet blanket? What's this question? That's that's an awakening potion. I don't need to do that yet. Okay. Get a guard start taking care of them. Here I go. Okay. An enemy detachment from the rear? Take them out now. We can't afford the race. Okay. There is not a question. You go there. Please. Excuse me. Just head here and start I'm defending. I'm going to Shadow Slide. I don't know why it brings my cursor back there. Warp here. Bye. We will soon control the area. Awakening so that we can take care of the Paladins. Goodbye. Crit right here. Uh, I didn't get all of them. There we go. Got the shoe. Soldiers in the northwest, yeah, yeah. mercenary. Consider it done. There we go. Okay. There's not a question. Going to play Siguri. Where did the other paladin go? I said I'd hand them the victory, and I'm not going to back down now. Come on, come on, come on. That was all I needed. There we go. <laughs> I was not paying attention. I was just pushing down the button. Like, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Initiate strategy. Is that potion there? Oh, that's not a potion. That's a... Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I can use that. I can just let this rip. Okay, now we're going to switch over to Ferdinand just to make the fight against Yuri go quicker. Where is he? There he is. Yeah, if you say so. Okay, now we switch back to Shez. There's not a question of can. Let me go here. I'm going the wrong way. So I'll open up in just a few moments. I must stop the enemy here. We cleared away to the shoal. We can attack from the east now. All eyes on Alois. I've got this. In other words, form a pincer and bear down on Roderick's position. Um, specifically you. You go there. Specifically you. Excuse me. 
Keep your unassigned adjutant. Okay, that should be done now. Bernadetta, you're going to go and stay down here for a moment to guard there. in danger. I'd better go back. I have to convince the Empire I'm worth keeping around. Destroy the bridge and cut the mercenaries off from the main force. Come on. The bridge. I can't get back to Rodrigue. Rodrigue has been cut off. Move in and strike before the mercenaries can rejoin you. No, this is our chance to kill the Ashen Demon. There's no nope, not happening. Here. Not listening to you. I have to reach the commander as soon as possible. Okay, um. I'm just gonna do this. Come on. There we go. There we go. Okay, there we go. Okay, now Edelgard goes and seizes that. Sorry, Alois. Kick your butt real fast. This time. They're not getting away that quickly. Nope. Still got you again. If I can defeat you before your cutscene even shows up, I will be very happy. I wasn't quite able to do it. That's fine though. Here for me? You must be eager to die. Oh my gosh, camera. The demon is too speedy. We are not Please tell me that hit. Oh, for the love of Okay, that must have hit him. There we go. Come on. Please, is this okay? There is not a quest. Leave this. This is not it. It seems this moment. Uh, no, no. This works. Care if I don't get the silver shield, I'm okay with it. Forgive me, Felix. Protect his majesty and Vargas. Okay, and the battle's actually over this time. Yes, there we go. I'm too late. Oh. I leave to take care of one backup squad and come back to this. 
What a mess. Rodrigue is slain and the kingdom put to rout. Will you and your mercenaries yield? Yes, please say yes. I see no other choice. Yes. Victory is ours. This is the right timeline. Soldiers, raise your voices loud. This is the correct timeline. <laughs> this is the one that I'm going with. What can I say? You got us. You rolled right over us and took out our employer. <laughs> I know when it's time to raise the white flag. Wait, that's it? You're giving up? We faced you in battle many times, only to be bested at every turn. Yeah, you've pretty much run us out of business by now. It's not easy finding new clients in the best of times. And no matter how good our reputation is, None of it matters if we can't actually win. At this rate, I'll have to stop calling myself the Blade Breaker. In that case, do you have any interest in working for us? Yes, 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 yes. The Empire. Hmm. Yes. It's true that your fighters and mine have waged many a bloody battle. But did you oppose us out of principle, or was it merely a business decision? Assuming you have no deep-seated animosity for Adrestia, I would welcome you with open arms. In the Empire, those with talent are given an outlet appropriate for their abilities. Yeah, you should join us. I mean, by now we all know firsthand how strong you are. And sure, there might be some folks here and there who have reservations about you fighting on our side. But they'll definitely come around once they see how dependable you are. What do you say? I doubt the kingdom will have any jobs for us after all of this. No better time for a fresh start. I agree. What about you, Halois? It might be strange, working against your old night friends. I've already made my decision. I have sworn to follow this father yes. wherever he goes. If my old allies want to come grill me over a fire, I'll just have to make myself more obscure. <laughs> that one is pretty good. That's a good one. That is good. <laughs> if I don't slay my foes by the sword, I will do so by the joke. That one was pretty good. <laughs> it actually is really clever. Well, guess that's that. Just tell us when we start. I'll go talk to the group and smooth things over. You two, stay here with the client. Got it. Thanks. Understood, Captain. Our troops will also want an explanation, so we'd better get to it. Oh boy, this is gonna make for some awkward interaction between us, isn't it? Yep. Hey, yep. Hi, Arbel. Well, I didn't expect that we just recruit them. I'm okay with that. I'm more than okay with that. I'm very happy with that. Oh, as long as Gerald didn't have to die, I was okay. We didn't get the silver shield. Oh no. I really haven't been using accessories anyway. I won't let you can also probably buy a silver shield. If I really decide I need it. Oh, look at that. I just wasn't going to be able to get it fast enough, so. We get a master seal and I'm okay with I'm more happy about that. Yes. It's me! Here he's now. Okay, sure. Geralt is playable. Yes! Finally, he's not a green unit. <laughs> Interesting, though. It didn't say Aloise is playable, even though he said he's sticking with us. So you're Geralt the Bladebreaker, huh? And I guess that makes you the Ashen Demon. You guys look tougher than a box of nails. No wonder we've had our hands full. Please, make yourself at home. The Imperial Army is most delighted to welcome you into its embrace. 
My name is Ferdinand von Eyre. You might say I am something of a leader figure around here, as I essentially hold the entire army together. Oh no, not more strangers! In another timeline, you were actually very familiar with these guys. It's not like you don't encounter strangers every time we take the battlefield. That's a good point. Wait, is it? Has anyone ever inspected you for crests before? Don't, don't do it. You're gonna open up a whole can of worms you don't want to deal with right now. Are you having interest in a sword fight? I am curious to see the stuff of which you are made. Okay, that one's fine. Well, we sure got a lively crew here. <laughs> Get in there, kid. Let him show you the ropes. I suppose we didn't need to worry about bad blood. If anything, it would seem Her Majesty's path to victory just grew even shorter. Indeed. By the way, has anyone seen our mercenary friend? Yes. No, this time. Sorry about all this, Arval. Yes, we're good. I know you've only been giving me your powers because you want me to beat the Ashen Demon. Don't worry about it. It's for the best, right? For all my doomsaying, everything seems to be right as rain. And, well, if we tried to kill him, we would have failed. So, keep that in mind. Alternate timeline stuff. I hope you're right. What's wrong? Feeling lost now that you don't have an enemy to chase around the countryside? You better not. No, it's not that. I'm not lost. I know exactly what I've got to do. Win this war. I'm gonna help Edelgard and my friends usher in a new age in Fodland. Well, any snarky follow-up for that? It's hardly the first time you've mentioned it. I suppose it's a fine goal, yes. If that's what you want, then I'll just have to help you achieve it. After all, I'm your partner in destiny. I'm here for you and you alone. Yes. Save there. Yes. Scarlet. And if you look at the time, it's perfect timing. I'm going to wrap it up here. Perfect. I could not have timed that better, actually. Pact with the Lester Alliance, Edelgard can direct her might at the kingdom. And though it comes at no small price, well, the cutscene play though. Steadily gain the upper hand. But the kingdom does not stand idly by. Dimitri rallies the Western lords, led by House Dominic, blood of one of the ten elites, in a last-ditch effort to forestall the Empire. No, brother. Anything but that. You cannot force the relic onto Annette. Calm yourself. I've nearly bade her wield it, not sent her rushing off into the teeth of the enemy. It's all right, Father. I know I'm the only one who can do this. Just seeing the crest of Dominic and our hero's relic is going to improve everyone's morale. It shames me to thrust this task on you, when it should have fallen to that craven son of mine. Yes, I doubt we can expect Simon to return and wield the relic, considering how quickly he abandoned us. It seems I raised him poorly, yes. I should have taught him how our house managed to survive this long without starving or freezing. Don't look so sad, Uncle. Don't I'll worry, buddy. No matter returns. what timeline occurs, it always the ends up with the crusher. <laughs> Enough, Father. This is nothing compared to what the soldiers are going through at the front. So many people are fighting and dying out there. Some of them my good friends. Yeah, no, I still didn't want Ingrid to die, but that we didn't have a choice strong. about. Especially when I'm in the best position to help. Forgive me, Annette. If you sense any danger at all, child, promise me that you'll run. I couldn't bear to lose you. I know, Father. So let's just all do the best we can to keep our land safe.
And now we go into a cutscene with happy music. Here we get to play the territory. And, um, more resistance we're likely a lot more reasonably happy music. Because the Lord surrounding the no one we know had to die. To the I mean, Roderick did, but something tells me that most of us didn't really like him anyway. Brenius and Bellinus. There is no telling whether these houses will choose subjection. Felix definitely didn't like him. Regardless, we cannot simply ignore them as we attempt to march on the capital. We must seize control of each of their lands and establish footholds before continuing on. The Alliance is still doing everything we expected of them. There are no changes on that front. So as long as we continue tightening the vice around the kingdom, we're certain to fulfill your majesty's goals. Glad to hear it about the Alliance. Does this mean the war will be over soon? I feel some actual motivation coming on. Well, in that case... Nope, nope, never mind, motivation gone. That was a close one, Bernadetta. You almost got yourself assigned to the front lines. As for me, you know what to do. Just put me right at the front and let me start wrecking stuff. We shall see who does more wrecking of stuff, Caspar. I will not be letting you outshine me. Watch as I am bringing glory to Bridget and the Empire on the battlefield. I wonder if I'll find someone worth marrying before this war is over. Again, no. Hate to break it to you, but no. You will, Dorothea. You're amazing. That's optimistic, but no. Enough. It's easy to let your guard down when the end is in sight, and we can't... I've seen many a timelines, and it never happens. Stay disciplined. And together we will take Fulton's future. Or at the very least, you don't recognize it until after the war is over. Don't worry, Edelgard. We're ready to get this done. Right then. Let's start by taking care of the enemy in front of us. There we go. Here we go. <laughs> this is the start of a new chapter the way I wanted it to be. And we're going to start it the same way. Hmm. Assuming it gives me the same choices, of course. I have the most brilliant idea. Yes, it does. Naturally, this task falls to me. Shall we? Improve the training grounds. Yes, please. Okay, now we save. Gotta be careful and make sure that I'm gonna be saving it into the right slots now. There we go. Save twice because that was a pain in the butt, not gonna lie. <laughs> okay. There we go. Now, let's go ahead and head over to the end screen, shall we? Like that is a pretty good spot to end. I literally could not have timed it better. Couldn't have timed it better if I was trying. But there we go. We now have two paths of history. We've separated the timelines yet again. And I, of course, am sticking with this one because I refuse to let Geralt die in every single timeline that we play. <laughs> there is not a single route where he survives in three houses. So I am letting him live in three hopes. <laughs> no way, I'm just letting him die. And I'm very happy, and I'm very excited to see how our relationship with, I guess, ourself, how Arvel and Sothis gets along. Um, I guess in this case it's Star, but in many cases it's probably just Byleth or you um, get along with Shez or whatever you name them then. Just to see how that develops, since Sothis clearly does not like Arvel. Or something in regards to this. Not quite sure exactly what it is, but something's up, and I'm excited to see how it develops. But yes. We wrote history. And now, I think we'll tie it up for the day, wrap it up. If you enjoyed what you saw today, 
Feel free to leave a follow. It's a nice and easy way to say, hey, I like what you're doing. You're up to good work. It's also a nice and easy way to get notifications so you can catch every stream right as it goes live and not have to miss a single thing. Notifications are sent out through Twitch, of course. But you can also feel free to leave a follow on the channel's Twitter if you want to get notifications to an alternate platform. Um, if you're interested in seeing some of the past stuff I've done, maybe you want to see the start of a series where I've come from in terms of the story here, or you want to see some of the other stuff I've been working on recently, like Noita and AI Desomnium files, feel free to check out my YouTube channel. It's where I have all of my VODs. Regardless of how you choose to show your support, though, whether it be here, on Twitter, or on the YouTube channel, or some other way that I'm not thinking of right now, um, I, I greatly appreciate your support. It means a lot to me. So thank you. Yeah, hope you all have a wonderful day, night, morning, afternoon, evening, the time it happens to be wherever you are. And we'll see you all again later. Thanks for coming and hanging out.